Two identical boson of mass m are placed in one dimension potential v, vx is equal to half m omega square x square. The boson interact via weak potential v12 is equal to 0 exponential minus m capital omega x1 minus x2 ka whole square divided by 4 h cut. If x1 x2 denote the coordinate of a particle given that the ground state wave function of the harmonic oscillator is this psi 0 x m omega by pi h cross ki power 1 by 4 e k power minus m omega x square by 2 h cut. The ground state energy of the two boson system to the first order in V0 is. So, we have to determine the ground state energy. Solution We have V12 equals to V0 e k power minus m omega x1 minus x2 ka whole square divided by 4 h cut in the absence of any perturbation the ground state energy of the boson system is E0 is equals to N1 plus half H cut omega plus N2 plus half half H cut omega equals to H cut omega n1 equals to n2 equals to 0 and their corresponding corresponding wave function of the system is psi 0 x1 x2 equals to m omega by pi h cut power 1 by 4 e k power minus m omega square by 2 h cut into m omega pi h cut k power 1 by 4 e k power minus m omega x2 square by 2 h cut. The correction to the ground state energy in the presence weak perturbing potential is E1 1 is equals to psi 0 E1 2 psi 0 So that is equals to 4 m omega by pi h cut v0 into 0 to infinity 0 to infinity e to the power minus m omega x1 square plus x2 square divided by 2 h cut e to the power minus m omega x1 minus x2 i square by 4 h cut into e, into e to the power minus m omega e 
इंटू ई टू दी पावर माइनस एम ओमेगा बाय टू एच कट एक्स वन स्क्वायर प्लस एक्स टू स्क्वायर डी एक्स वन डी एक्स टू सो डेट इज दिस सिनेरियो दिस इंटीग्रल कैन बी मॉडिफाइड एस वन वुड बी फोर टू एम ओमेगा वी जीरो बाय पाई एच कट जीरो टू इन्फिनिटी ई रेस टू डी पावर माइनस एम ओमेगा वन एक्स स्क्वायर बाय एच कट इनटू ई रेस टू डी पावर माइनस एम ओमेगा एक्स वन स्क्वायर बाय फोर एच कट डी एक्स वन इनटू जीरो टू इन्फिनिटी ई रेस टू डी पावर माइनस एम ओमेगा एक्स टू स्क्वायर by h cut into e raised to the power minus m omega x2 square by 4 h cut dx2 here we have neglected the contribution of term x1 dot x2. So when we x open this, so we have just consider x1 square plus x2 square minus 2x1 dot x2. We have neglected it because its contribution is very small. So let us evaluate the value of each of these integral. I one is equals to e k to the power minus I m omega one x one square by h cut e raised to the power minus I m omega x one square by four h cut d x one can be written at e to the zero to infinity minus m by h cut omega This term is omega naught omega one, omega plus omega by four x one square d x one. So the integral of this, if we calculate, would be turn out to be one by two m by h cut omega plus omega by four. Power minus half. We have root pi. Here we have used identity. E raised to the power minus alpha x square zero to infinity x to the power n dx is equal to gamma n plus one by two into alpha to the power n plus one by two. Since n is equal to zero here. Since n is equal to zero, so we would be having gamma one by two into alpha to the power one by two. Gamma one by two will be one by two root pi. So our result integral for this would be this. And similarly, similarly, i two is equal to e raised to the power zero to infinity m omega x two square by h cut e raised to the power minus m omega x two square by four h cut dx is equal to zero to infinity e raised to the power minus m by h cut omega plus omega by four x two square dx would be equals to same value root pi by two M by h cut into omega plus omega by four to power minus half. So substitute the value of integral.
in the expression of E. We get E is equals to four M omega V zero divided by pi H cut one root pi by two to M by H cut omega plus omega by four ki power. 1 by 2 minus root pi by 2 m by h cut omega plus omega by 4 ki power minus half. Now one can check it out. Root pi will cancel root pi root pi pi 2 2 4 cancel out. m by this is m by h cross this is m by h cross minus 1. So our result would turn out to be v0 omega divided by omega plus gamma by 4 which can be written as v0 divided by 1 plus omega by 4 omega and this can be written as v0 is equals to 1 plus gamma by 2 omega sorry the power minus half so the corrected ground state energy for this bosonic system is E0 is equals to E0 0 plus E1 that is H cross omega plus V0 into 1 plus gamma omega by 2 omega ki power minus half. Thus, our answer for this problem would be option C. H cross here is 2 is missing. Thus, correct in the correct uh, answers in the correct uh, in the question, there is a factor of 2 which is missing in typing here. So, the correct option for this problem is option C. In a basis in which z components as z of the spin is divalent and electron is in the space states, psi is given by this. The probability that a measurement of s z will yield the values h cross by 2 and minus h cross by 2 are respectively. Solution We have psi is equals to 1 plus iota by root 6 and root 2 by 3. The poll is a spin matrix as z is defined as as z is equals to h cross by 2 1 0 0 minus 1 the eigenvalue and its corresponding eigenvectors of spin as z matrix r that is as z is equals to plus h cross by 2 and its corresponding eigenfunction is 1 0 as z is equals to minus h cross by 2 and its corresponding eigenfunction is 0 comma 1 now 
determining the probability of finding the particle having h l is equals to positive h cross by 2 is p is equals to positive h cross by 2 would be phi 1 dot psi is square that is One zero one plus I root six divided by root three come mod square will give us what one by three. Similarly The probability that the measurement yield the value measurement of as yield the value minus h cross by 2 is p of minus h cross by 2 is equals to mod psi into psi of minus h cross by 2 mod square that is 0 comma 1 into 1 plus i by root 6 divided by root 2 by 3 mod square is 2 by 3. So, our answer for this is 1 by 3, 2 by 3, option D. Consider the normalized state of a particle in one dimensional harmonic oscillator psi is equals to B10, B21 where 0 and 1 denotes the ground and first excited state and b1 and b2 are real constant the expectation value of displacement x in the state will become minimum when so we have to determine at when this uh, expectation value becomes minimum solution we have psi is equals to b 1 0 plus b2 1 where psi dot psi is equals to b1 square 0 comma 0 plus b2 square 1 comma 1 equals to 1 implies b1 square plus b2 square is equals to 1. Next, the expectation value of x is expectation value of would be given by b1 square 0 x 0 b2 square 1 x 1 b1 b2 would be 1 x 0 plus b2 b1 would be 0 x 1 now here we are using the standard 
result of harmonic oscillator m x n will be root over h cross by twice m omega bracket means root over n plus 1 delta m into n plus 1 plus root n delta m into n minus 1 now let us compute the value of each of the inner product in the expression of average x the value of 0 x 0 we can check it out if both the term are the same that is initial m and 0 are 0 and m and n are same in that case delta would be 0 1 0 minus 1 this value would turn out to be 0 similarly if 1 x 1 is also turn out to be the 0 the value of third term was 1 x 0 1 x 0 will be h cross by twice m omega root over here I would be having it 0 plus 1 delta m is 1 comma 1 plus a state 0 so second state would be 0 so 1 there is no place of minus 1 so this term would multiply so result will be h cross by 2m omega similarly for 0 x 1 we will be having it root over h cross by twice omega in that case we would be having it 1 plus 1 delta 1 comma 2 plus root over 1 into 0 comma 0 so second term will be survived again we will be having h cross by 2m omega inserting all these values in the expression of x x we get average x is equals to twice b1 b0 equals to h cross by 2m omega now from the options this value will become minimum when b2 is equals to 0 and b1 is equals to 0 so minimum value will be 0 if any of the term either b1 b2 is equals to 0 or b1 is equals to 1 or b1 equals to 0 or b2 equals to 1 so minimum value can be 0 and that can only happen if this is a possible combination from the action we can check it in the option a b2 is becoming 0 and b1 is equals to 1 so this is our correct answer for the given problem dear knowledge of function of a particle and a spherically symmetric potential is given by psi r is equals to z fr where fr is a function of radial variable r the eigenvalue of the operator l square is solution we have psi of r is equals to z of fr which can be written as r of fr into cos theta or which I am writing is equals to a cos theta where a I am defining as nothing but rfr take a further the angular momentum
operator is defined as L square is equals to minus I H cross, sorry. H cross is square 1 by sin theta, del by del theta, sin theta, del by del theta, plus 1 by sin square theta, del square by del phi square. Applying psi on L square we get L square psi is equals to minus H cross square 1 by sin theta del by del theta sin theta del by del theta A cos theta plus 1 by sin square theta del square by del phi square is cos theta. Now, this term, second term would be 0, so we would have minus h square a 1 by sin theta del by del theta sin theta minus sin theta plus 0 is equals to h square a 1 by sin theta del by del theta sin square theta equals to h cross square a 1 by sin theta 2 sin theta cos theta which is turning out to be this would cancel 2 h square a cos theta it can be written to h square psi. Thus, the eigenvalue corresponding to operator L square is H cross square. Now, is there any other method to solve this problem easily? Yes. So, other method is psi of R is equals to or psi of Z F R. Z is defined as R of F R into cos theta. Now express this cos theta in terms of harmonic spherical har which can be written as R of F of R would be root 4 pi by 3 y 1 0. Now if L square operate on y lm we get l square psi of r would be r f of r root 4 pi by 3 l square y 1 0 would give us r f of r root 4 pi by 3 h square 1 into 1 plus 1 into y 1 0 so this term would give us 2 h cross square r f of r 4 pi by 3 y 1 0 which is nothing but 2 h cross square psi of r. So this is a shortcut where we can express the given wave function in a spherical harmonics and determine what is its value of l square and l z. So, correct answer for this problem would be option D. In the burn approximation, the scattering amplitude f theta of a cover potential Vr is equals to beta a k power minus mu r by r is given by in the following b is equals to 2k sin theta by 2 
इज इक्वल्स टू एच स्क्वायर के स्क्वायर बाय टू एम सॉल्यूशन वी हैव वी आर इज इक्वल्स टू बीटा ए के पर माइनस मीओ आर पर आर सिंस the potential is spherical symmetric the scattering amplitude of the particle f of theta would be माइनस का टू एम डिवाइडेड बाय एच स्क्वायर बी जीरो टू इन्फिनिटी आर वी आर साइन बी आर डी आर वेयर बी इज इक्स टू टू के साइन थीटा बाय टू एंड के स्क्वायर वुड बी ट्वाइस एम ई बाय एच क्रॉस स्क्वायर एंड थीटा इज द स्कैटरिंग एंगल सब्सटीट्यूटिंग वैल्यू ऑफ पोटेंशियल इन एफ ऑफ थीटा वी गेट एफ ऑफ थीटा जी कस टू माइनस टू एम बीटा एच स्क्वायर बी इन टू आर जीरो टू इंफिनिटी ए टू द पावर माइनस मी ओ आर बाय आर साइन बी आर डी आर इज इक्वल्स टू टू माइनस टू एम बीटा एच स्क्वायर बी जीरो टू इन्फिनिटी के पास माइनस मी ओ आर साइन बी आर डी आर विच कैन बी रिटर्न एज माइनस म्यू बीटा बाय एच स्क्वायर बी आई जीरो टू इन्फिनिटी ए के पावर माइनस म्यू आर ए टू द पावर आई क्यू आर माइनस आई क्यू आर सो इस बी आर आई बी आर माइनस आई बी आर टी आर सो विच कैन बी रिटर्न माइनस म्यू बीटा एच स्क्वायर बीटा आई जीरो टू इन्फिनिटी की पावर माइनस म्यू माइनस आई बीटा आर माइनस माइनस म्यू प्लस आई बी आर डी आर सो दिस टर्म उड़ गए माइनस म्यू बीटा एच स्क्वायर क्यू आई Divided by one minus mu plus mu minus i b minus mu plus i b is equal to minus mu b ta एच स्क्वायर 
बी आई इंटू टू आई बी डिवाइडेड बाय म्यू स्क्वायर बी स्क्वायर माइनस और सॉरी प्लस और आई वुड बी राइटिंग इट माइनस टू म्यू सॉरी दिस टर्म इज एम आई हैव रॉन्गली रिटर्न म्यू एम 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 एंड हेयर इट इज एम एम बीटा डिवाइडेड बाय एच स्क्वायर म्यू स्क्वायर प्लस बी स्क्वायर सो दिस इज अवर आंसर विच मीन्स माइनस ऑप्शन बी नाउ क्वेश्चन कम्स टू अवर माइंड कैन वी सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम यूजिंग और विदाउट एनी कैलकुलेशन सो द आंसर फॉर दिस प्रॉब्लम इज यस वी कैन सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम इवन विदाउट डूइंग एनी कैलकुलेशन वी नो इट फर्दर फॉर कुलम्बिक पोटेंशियल वन बाय आर Our scattering cross section is proportional to cosec to power four theta by two. That means f of theta would be proportional to one by sine square theta by two. So if I substitute mu is equal to zero, and that term which give us one by sine square theta by two would be our answer. So let us check it out here. If I put up here b is equal to two k sine theta by four. तो दिस टर्म वुड गिविंग अस बीटा स्क्वायर का स्क्वायर मीन साइन की पावर फोर थीटा बाई टू सो डेट इज नॉट अवर आंसर इफ आई हैव सब्सटीट्यूट म्यूजिकल्स टू जीरो डेट गिव अस बी रूट ऑफ बी स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ बी स्क्वायर सिंपली बी बी वुड बी टू के साइन थीटा बाई टू डेट मीन्स डेट इज नवर आंसर एंड दिस टर्म इज बी स्क्वायर प्लस थ्री बी की पावर सिक्स मीन्स साइन की पावर सिक्स वन बाय साइन की पावर सिक्स थीटा बाई टू डिपेंडेंस वन बाय साइन की पावर थीटा बाय टू डिपेंडेंस वन बाय साइन की पावर फोर थीटा बाई टू डिपेंडेंस एंड दिस टर्म डिपेंडेंस इज वन बाय साइन स्क्वायर थीटा बाई टू सो अवर आंसर वुड बी ऑप्शन डू डेट इज इवन विदाउट डूइंग एनी कैलकुलेशन If diagonal function of the Hamiltonian with potential v is equal to v r, then the expectation value of the operator l x square plus l y square in the state psi is is we have to determine the value solution. We have psi is equal to one by five three psi two one one. Plus psi two one zero minus root fifteen psi two one minus one where psi dot psi is equal to one. Expressing the operator l x square and l y square in the eigen basis of l square and l z we get that is l square equals to l x square plus l y square plus l z square implies l x square plus l y square equals to l square minus l z square Thus, expectation value of l square x square plus l y square would be equal to psi l x square plus l y square psi that can be written as psi l square minus l z square psi, which can be further written as h cross square psi. L into L plus one minus m square psi. So, average L x square plus L y square is written as nine by twenty five psi two one one plus two one into one plus one minus one square 
to psi 211 plus 1 by 25 h cross square psi 210 into 11 1 plus 1 minus 0 square 210 plus 15 by 25 h cross square psi 21 minus 1 into 1 into 1 plus 1 minus of minus 1 square into psi 21 1 minus 1 that is turning about to lx square plus ly square 9 by 25 h cross square plus 1 by 25 h cross square plus 15 here this is 2 15 by 25 h cross square turning out to be 26 by 25 h cross square thus our answer for this problem would be option d 26 by 25 h cross square consider a two dimension infinite square potential well vx y is equals to 0 to infinity 0 in the region x less between 0 and a y between 0 and a infinity otherwise the function is given by this where nx and y 1 2 3 if a perturbation h dash which is v0 in the region 0 x a by 2 0 y a by 2 and 0 otherwise is applied the correction to the energy of first excited state to the order v0 is so we have to determine the correction in the first excited energy state now let us write it down the solution we have h dash is equals to v0 in the region 0 x a by 2 0 y a by 2 infinity otherwise take it the normalize wave function is given by psi nx ny is equals to 2 by a sin nx pi x y a sin ny pi y by a the excited state is a degenerate state having nx and y as one comma two and or two comma one so this problem is related to degenerate perturbation okay now we have to construct perturbed matrix H perturbed matrix so we have to construct this matrix that is H perturbed would be equals to 1 comma 2 h dash 1 comma 2 1 comma 2 2 
h dash 2 comma 1 2 comma 1 h dash 1 comma 2 2 comma 1 h dash 2 comma 1 now we have to evaluate the value of each of the inner products mentioned in the matrix one comma two H dash one comma two will be let us first define the wave function one comma two psi one comma two would be defined as two by a sine pi x by a sin 2 pi x by a and 2 comma 1 state here I can write 1 comma 2 2 comma 1 is 2 by a sin 2 pi x by a sin this term is y sin pi y by a now so, first term, the value of first term, is 1 comma 2 h dash 1 comma 2 is equals to 2 by a square, we note come outside, 0 to a by 2, sin square pi x by a, dx 0 to a by 2 sin square 2 pi y by a dy this term is turning out to 2 by a square v naught the value of first integral be a by 4 the value of second integral is a by 4 so we would get v naught by 4 similarly Two comma one H dash two comma one would be two by A square V zero zero to A by two sine square two pi x by A dx zero say A by two sine square pi y A to dy which is equal to two by A square V zero a by 4 into a by 4 which is turning out to be naught by 4 now the component one comma two h dash two comma one is equals to two comma one h dash one comma two so both this component would be having same value we can take it any one 2 comma 1 is equals to 2 comma 1 h dash 1 comma 2 is equals to 2 by a square v 0 0 to a by 2 sine 2 pi x dx sin pi x oh sorry 2 pi x by a and pi x by a dx into 0 say a by 2 sin pi y a into sin 2 pi y a into dy the value of integration 
this integration would turn out to be 16 by 9 pi square. So, inserting all these values in the mat perturbed matrix, we get H per tab equals to V0 by 4, 16 V0 by 9 pi square, 16 V0 by 9 pi square, V0 by 4, the eigenvalue. of the matrix are obtained from circular equation that is H P minus lambda I equals to zero implies v naught by 4 minus lambda is equals to 16 v0 by 9 pi square 16 v0 by 9 pi square v naught by 4 minus lambda equals to 0 implies v naught by 4 minus lambda square minus 16 v naught by 9 pi square equals to 0 implies lambda is equals to v naught by 4 plus minus 16 v 0 by 9 pi square. So, our answer would be option B because here if we take v naught by 4 outside we would be having 1 plus minus 64 by 9 pi square. So, our answer is option B is correct for this problem. The bound on the ground state energy with an attractive delta potential namely h is equal to minus h square by 2m d square by dx square minus a delta x square using the variation with trial wave function psi x is equal to a k power minus b x square is so we have to determine the ground state energy solution we have psi of x is equals to a the power minus b x square the normalization constant Jason constant are determined from normalization condition that is psi dot psi equals to 1 implies mod a square minus infinity to infinity minus 2b x square dx equals to mod a square pi by 2b k power 1 by 2 equals to 1 implies mod a is equals to 2b k power pi k power 1 by 4 thus the normalized wave function is given by psi of x is equals to 2b by pi to power 1 by 4 e to power minus b x square where b is variational 
parameter the Hamiltonian for the system is is equals to 2m by dx square minus alpha del x the energy from this Hamiltonian is given by A is equals to psi x at psi x to psi x at square by 2 m by dx square minus alpha del x into psi x is equals to minus h square by twice m psi l square psi by del x square minus alpha psi x into del x into psi x. Let us evaluate the value of each of these inner product separately so the value of first term of inner product is psi del square psi by del x square is equals to psi minus 2b plus 4b square x square psi x which is equals to minus 2b psi of psi plus 4b square psi x square psi. Now, or psi d square psi by dx square is to minus 2b plus 4b square 2b ki power pi ki power 1 by 2 g minus infinity 2 infinity x square e ki power minus 2 b x square dx equals to minus 2 b plus 4 b square 2 b ki power pi ki power 1 by 2 2 root pi ki power pi divided by 4 into 1 by 2 2 b ki power 3 by 2 is turning out to be minus 2 b plus 4 b square divided by 1 by 4 b is equals to minus b. Similarly, the value of second term of inner product is psi of x is equal to psi of x 2b by pi k power 1 by 2 minus infinity to infinity delta x minus 2b x square dx is equals to 2b pi k power 1 by 2 e k power 
2b x square with x is equal to 0. That means 2b pi ki power 1 by 2. Here we have used the property delta x fx dx is equal to f of 0. Here this function becomes e to the power 0. Substituting these values in the expression expression of energy we get E of B is equal to H square B by 2M minus alpha 2B ki power 1 by 2. The value of variational parameter B is obtained by differentiating AB with respect to B. With respect to B, we get that is del e as a function of b into db is equal to h square by twice m minus alpha 2 by pi ki power 1 by 2 1 by 2 b ki power minus half equals to 0 implies b is equal to 2 alpha ki power 4 divided by pi h cross 4 substituting the value of b in expression of eb we get e minimum is equal to h square 2 m square alpha ki power 4 divided by pi h ki power 4 divided by 2m minus alpha and here I would be having it 2 by pi into m square 2 alpha k power 4 by pi h k power 4 this here I made a mistake this term would be alpha square square so a square so what do we get and that is 1 by 2 so here I we get m square alpha square by pi h to the power 4 minus 2 alpha square m here m to alpha square m by pi h square which is minus m alpha square by pi h square so let us check which of the answer is correct option c is correct i have taken by mistake this as alpha so option C is correct. Option C is correct for this problem. Consider two different systems, each with three identical non-interacting particles, both having single single particle state with energies epsilon, 3 epsilon and 5 epsilon. One system is populated by spin half fermion and other by boson. What is the value of EF minus EB where EB 
EF and EB are the ground state energy of fermionic and bosonic system respectively. So, solution. We have three system. Fermion, boson, the energy of this system, this level is epsilon, 3 epsilon naught, 5 epsilon naught, epsilon naught, 3 epsilon naught, 5 epsilon naught. Now, in case of bermion, the distribution of electron would be, particle would be like this, in case of boson, the distribution of particle would be like this. So, energy for fermion that is EF will be 2 epsilon 0 plus 3 epsilon 0 equals to 5 epsilon 0. Energy of Boson system is EB will be EB will be equals to three epsilon. The value of F minus EB is EF minus EB is equals to 5 epsilon 0 minus 3 epsilon 0 equals to 2 epsilon 0. Thus, our correct answer for this problem is option B, that is 2 epsilon 0. If the operator AB satisfies the commutator relation I AB is equals to I, where I is the identity operator, then Solution We have e to the power a dot b and i a dot b is equals to i. Now let us take let a is equals to x and b is equals to p. Then, commutator of x dot p according to quotient is i and this value will be written as e to the power x into p. We can use, write it down, minus p e to the power x. Now, this can be written as minus the com this commutator we b a would be in general if i x p is equals to this so this would be minus i because here in the denominator we would be having it p cross x commutator so this term would be minus i using using our calculation And here I would be having a del by del x of e to the power x, which is turning out to be i e to the power x or is equals to simply e to the power x, where I have used the property. So we can simply write it down e a b is nothing but equals to e a here i have used the property commutator of p as a function of f x would be commutator of p with x into del f of x by del x so i have written this use this properties instead of expanding the exponential term and take it the conjugates and all that stuff it's better to use this this identity and get the answer in a very uh, i would begin
in a simpler manner. So the correct answer for this would be option A.